So now we come to John chapter 4. And in John chapter 4, we have Jesus talking to a woman in the middle of the day. And this woman is asking a question about worship. And the question is, do you go here or do you go there for worship? And Jesus comes back with a very interesting phrase. He says, the hour is coming and now is when the true worshiper, in other words, you don't want the worshiper going here and going there. What you want is the true worshiper, the right worshiper, okay, doing it the right way. The true worshiper will worship the Father in spirit and in truth. For such the Father seeks. In other words, the Father is seeking people, not necessarily going to this place or that place, but the ones that are really worshiping Him in spirit. So um, then the next phrase, Jesus says, God is spirit. And those who worship Him must worship Him in spirit and in truth. So again, we have another verse in the Bible with the word spirit twice. One is a capital S spirit, indicating the spirit of God. And the other one is the smaller case S, indicating the human spirit. That is our spirit, our personal human spirit. And so it says God is spirit, which means the nature of God is just spirit. That's why you can't see him in the physical realm. He's not in the physical realm. He's in the spiritual realm. God is spirit. And those that worship him must worship him where? In spirit. So you have the spirit and you have our spirit.